here I am going to show how to connect the DJI wireless mic into the laptop to record your audio and record your screen using this OBS 29.1.1 version app in the Windows laptop to record your screen and if you want to create a content using sharing your screen this is an unbelievably easy setup to do so first off you will have to install OBS software and once you're done it's, it can be installed either as a software from their own website or using going to Microsoft App Store click on Microsoft App and you can find OBS Studio right over here as an app so I did install OBS Studio app which is rated at 4.6 on average uh, among the 314 users and it is a very good well implemented app it's very intuitive, very convenient to use. I did not go through any user manual to set this up. It was very easy. All right, so once installed, you will have to update this uh, OBS Studio. Once you have updated the OBS Studio, you will be greeted with an interface like this that will show you what you can do and how you can record your screen. So I primarily installed this OBS Studio to record my screen and make content about editing videos and photos. So here you can see that I have created a new screen called screen recording. This is a scene. Now I want to create a source. So I will go to hit the plus icon and here display capture. I'm capturing the display and under the display capture you will be asked which screen. If you have multiple screens, which screen to select to capture the display. Once you have selected the display, next you move on to the audio. So here is where we'll be setting up the DJI wireless microphone. I will show you in this video so here is how I will be setting up the DJI wireless mic you have to take up the USB-C type uh, connector to uh, the receiver end of the DJI and the microphone end of the DJI goes into any of your setup however you feel convenient to set it up you can actually use it just by adjusting the pin over to your collar once that is done you all you need to do is plug this USB-C port from the audio receiver into your USB-C port of the laptop once you're done under the settings system sound and in the sound you can see under the input you will be able to find your wireless microphone as microphone wireless microphone RX so if you click on that you will be getting to the screen so as you can see here by default input volume settings will be 45 which is perfectly fine this is the level of audio that you are able to hear right now because there are some more settings that you need to change in the OBS Studio. So in OBS Studio, under the audio mixer, you will have to click on the three dots on the right side. As you can see here, the audio that I'm speaking is being recorded in dual channel mode, two channels, right? If it is a single channel, it will be just one line. Here it is a dual channel. And here you will be able to go to properties. Under properties, all you need to do is just choose the audio device as it is in the settings all right so since I have chosen the wireless microphone RX it is going to bring the volume from that microphone once that is done you will be able to see the volume slider being moved every time you speak over here once that is done you can even add a transition fade when you are starting up the video and you can directly hit recording to start video and hit stop recording to stop the video once that is done, you will be able to find your recorded video under videos in your library and it will, it will be getting saved. So as I'm speaking, this video is getting saved. So once I hit stop, you will be able to see this audio recording being saved as a MKV file. So this is how to set up your screen recording setup to record your screens and if you're going to demonstrate something by screen recording you can do this way this is absolutely perfect in case you need a wireless solution peace